Today is the official uh, renaming ceremony for the Sergio Troncoso Library. It used to be the Isleta Branch Library, but uh, you know we renamed it uh, Sergio Troncoso. And we were looking for a name uh, to rename the library, and you know the first person that I thought of was uh, Sergio Troncoso. You know, someone who is from Isleta, someone who's a writer, someone who's published, and someone who's very accomplished. You know that the young kids in the area can look up to as a role model. So it was a very easy choice for me uh, when when we were thinking of, of who to rename the library after. And the library um, is really an icon of of, of the future of children, and, and the children are our future. And you can see here, you know, a lot of families um, reading to their children. And I think that's really important um, today because children really just have this powerful imagination, and you can really dive into these books, get lost in it, get lost in the characters and, and the stories. So I think it's just it's it's just really really exciting that that we uh, that he's developing programs like this for future generations for our children and grandchildren. And I'm always here in Isleta and I'm always grateful for uh, being from here. You know, having the, the, the Isleta Branch Library named after me is probably one of the deepest and best honors I've ever gotten. The libraries for me were the place that gave me a sanctuary, uh, a, a place for my imagination to grow, for my mind to get stronger. This honor, that's what it means to me. It means that um, you know, this kind of sanctuary, uh, I hope when a new kid comes to this library and they see the Sergio Troncoso Library, he said, this is the kid from the neighborhood. I can do what he did. I can actually maybe do it better than he can. You know, he's from Isleta. He's, he's a kid who did not have any money, but he loved to read. And reading took him everywhere.